Good afternoon everyone, welcome back to my channel, Elsa the Bargain Hunter here. I am here to bring you a very tiny haul from Five Below, a card that I received yesterday, a Valentine's card, and a little chit chat that I will get into towards the end. Um, I want to have the little chit chat because it's a stress relief for me. So we'll get into that in a little bit. But first I want to share a card. I did get a card from Brie over at Crafty Hippie Halls. I won't show the front because I haven't um, covered the addresses. But there's a cute little smiley balloon in the front. Thank you, sweetie. And I did slice it open to save some time. <clears throat> so I'm just going to show you guys real quick. Wishing you a heart full of laughter, laughter and love. Oh, thank you. Look at all the hearts. It's a Valentine's card. Thank you, twin. Me and Bree call each other twins. After getting to know each other more, we realize we have a lot in common, including the birth of our children, well, her child and my children. She wrote inside, hope you have an amazing V-Day, twin. See, I told you. Thanks so much for the love and support. And then it says... Wishing you a heart full of laughter and love. And then the inside says, today and always, happy Valentine's Day. Love, heart, love, breathe. And she also added these heart stickers. Thank you, sweetie. Really cute. Those are really cute. Yeah, we found out that we have a lot in common. And um, her daughter, Scarlett, is very young. She's a young mother. So, you know, whenever possible, I try to give her some tips or if she's going through something, I try to help her out. Being a mother is not easy, guys. <laughs> I'll tell you. Honey, thank you so much. Um, went out with my daughter. My daughter came over Friday, her and Eli, and perfect timing. And we went shopping today. And she hit a couple of stores. She went, we went to Burlington Factory, Five Below. I think that was it to have some pizza i love pizza and we grabbed some of this she grabbed me a couple of things that was excited <clears throat> she grabbed me for only five dollars is a room to room letter board it's a felt letter board it has 145 pieces alphabet numbers and symbols so that's cool i just gotta find out what to actually put on it because i don't want to keep changing it I like what it says here. Life is tough, but so are you. That's perfect. I didn't even realize it said that. So that's cute. I like that. Maybe you guys can help me out as to what to put on here. So I can display what I do in my videos. <laughs> that's cute. Yeah, we found this. That was $5. And then we found this, and it just brought back memories. I don't know if you guys remember these. I'm sure you do. A lot smaller, though. Remember these dot candies? <laughs> I see these and I said to my daughter, please, Dee, let me have them. <laughs> so she did. And these were $2. Brings back memories. My mother used to tear it apart and give us each a strip, a color. This is cool. So I got these. Well, she got these for me. And a couple of other things. That's actually for friend mail, so I'm just going to not show that <laughs> yet. Um, That was it from Five Below and the card. Thank you, twin. And I just wanted to come on real quick and I'm... Um, like I said, release and stress. Some of you guys may have noticed I've been missing in action since Thursday or Friday. On Friday, I was texting with Fatima, my family's Fatima, over a different issue, and I just suddenly stopped. And I received a phone call, a very disturbing phone call, that for the moment, for the weekend, just um, turned my world around. And um, it's very hard, very, very hard with the news that I received. <clears throat> But my daughter showed up and Eli showed up and I had to show the, the the happy face, you know, which wasn't easy. And today I decided to go visit my mom at the cemetery. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you would see that picture that I took of the um, tombstone. And I just wanted to let you guys know, guys, if life is short. Not that anyone has passed. The bad news is not of the passing of anyone. But um, life is too short. And you can have somebody there one second and they could be gone, whether it's, God forbid, through death, like in that case with my mom. It's going to be 14 years now in June. Or just 
pawn for a little bit, I know. And it's hard. Being a parent is hard. Being an individual is hard. So just, you know, live life to the best. Just don't take advantage of it. I mean, take advantage of it to the best of your ability where it, 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 it suits you. Just don't live it upset. Don't live it uh, holding grudges. Don't, don't do that. It's not worth it. It's not worth it because that person might not be there. Even if somebody that's not in your life all the time, that person might be gone for a little while longer than you want them to be. And it's just, it's no fun, you know? And now that I look at the felt, the letter board that my daughter got me, it says, life is tough, but so are you. I thought I was. And I am. But not to the point where I want to be, because I just can't be that way. I've had episodes of crying over the weekend. And just popping up back upstairs and just with a happy smile on my face, you know? But anyway. um, Yeah, guys, just don't hold any grudges. It's not worth it. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.